I'm right across the street from UT Frank Irwin Center where they play basketball. I'm on Red River and uh, Martin Luther King. And this building here is the oldest building that's still in use, current use, everyday use, at the University of Texas. But that story is for another day. I'm here to see the oldest building on the UT campus, at, but no one uses it. It's been shut up since 2009. Now, like I said, I'm on Red River, and this house I'm gonna look at, you're not gonna be able to see it, but it has a private driveway. To give you an idea of where we are, that's the UT School of Nursing. It's right beside that. And this is the back entrance, or side entrance, I guess you'd say, to the New Dell Medical School, okay? So the current address of this old house we're gonna go see on the UT campus is 500 East 18th Street. Now you notice there's a zero missing, it says 50, but this should be 500 East 18th, okay? Now, the house was built in 1853 for the sister-in-law of Jim Bowie, who the, the sister-in-law's name's Margaret Bowie. Now, if you're familiar with Texas history, you know Jim Bowie commanded the forces at the Alamo and died at the Alamo. You know the Bowie knife, so this is a private drive leading to the house. Okay, I'll try to get a shot of the house here, but I don't think I'll be able to from this location. I'm gonna put a link below the video. There's part of the house, okay? Uh, a link below this video for a second video I'll shoot from the upper levels. So you can see the house a little bit better, but it's, as you can see, it's in a grove of trees. So it's actually known as the Watson house. And Mr. Watson died in uh, 1983. And Texas, University of Texas took it over at that time. Someone actually lived in it to 2009, and then it was shut up. And there's been a few there was a big greenhouse at one time and they tore that down, but uh, no one is allowed inside because it's unsafe to be uninhabitable and I don't want, Texas don't want any to get sued. So, like I said, look for the video link down below and you'll see what I'm talking about. It, it's all grown up, you're not gonna be able to see much, but I wanted to show you this house that's the oldest structure on the UT campus built in, um, 1853, all right?